Mine's right there. Let's see. <clears throat> mama? That's the mama. <sighs> My wife is here. So I want you to tell us why uh, you visited unannounced. My son, your childlessness has been giving me sleepless nights and the restless days. I have been jumping from one solution center to the other. I thank God. God has decided to give me a solution. Yes. Um. Take this. When next you see your menstrual period, start eating it. From that particular day, that mbosi mbosi ahe na fair. Eat it until it finishes. Eh? From that day, you will no longer see your menstrual period until after nine months when you will put to bed. Oh, take. Emma, what nonsense is this? Mama, is everything okay with you? You came all the way from the village with this traditional nonsense and you expect my wife and I to eat it. Have you gone crazy? No! We're not going to take that. What nonsense is this? No, this is not nonsense. This is something that is going to help you and your wife to have a son. You mean you don't trust Mama, me? Mama, I don't care what you think. I don't care what you think. But I'm very disappointed at you. Ha! Mama, I'm sorry. But I, I don't think I'll be able to eat. But I don't know. All in the name of burying a child. Mm. I can't. Opagua. Opagua, witch! Witch! You have bewitched my son. You want him to die childless. Opagua, all your evil plan cannot work. You can't with a solution. Only you can't come with a solution. Mama, be careful. Are you working? Mama, be careful. Mama, I'm very disappointed at you. Be careful. Take that as well. Are you walking out on me? Edward! Be ashamed of yourself. I, th I thought you were a Christian. not work because I know the God I'm serving is a strong God. He's stronger than whatever charm that she's using on him. Zap! Zap! Why is this food? Zap it! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ma? Where is it? Where are you? Why open this gate? Okay, Why open this gate? What are you? Open the gate. Open the gate. Sorry, Mom. No, you suck your teeth down. You suck your teeth. You go keep this, you know. Okay. Oh, God, I've been a military married at you. I'm going to kill you. Oh, 
that Jezebel has sealed my son's conscience with a hot iron. He does not even see. He does not even reason like a normal human being anymore. He does not even see the reason to give birth. I don't know what to do again. I am tired of everything. Oh, wow. I mean, what do we call this now? Always we are on our because I don't understand how someone will be drowning in a pool of water. A helping hand is being stretched to help him, and he doesn't want to take it. He chooses to ignore the help and uh, uh, drown to death. I don't, I don't understand it. It is not going His senses have been taken away from him. He does not even know that he needs the help. He does not even know that he is drowning. Oh, God. Well, it's only God that can help in this situation because me, I'm tired. I have accepted my fate. I cannot give birth again. I don't know what to do. I'm tired. Just keep praying. God will answer our prayers. We have done what we are supposed to do as human beings. Hmm? Please, don't give up. And stop crying, man. It's okay. Oh, Lord, my God. I walked in ignorance then, not knowing that you have a better plan for me. Please, Father, don't use my ignorance against my daughter-in-law who have a baby for me now. Listen to her prayer and grant this family all we have been asking for you. Please, my king, please the glory of the glorious God. Ancient of the days, wipe away the tears of this family. Use this, my new daughter-in-law, to wipe away my shame and disgrace. Father, please, I beg you, I plead with you, my precious God. Do not punish me in my sins. Wipe away my tears and show me mercy. I need your mercy, oh Lord my God. This is all I am asking in Jesus' mighty name. I have prayed. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, precious God. Chai. Chai. Ogazo oh, is such he's such a nice man. Hey! What an angel in, in a human form. Oh! Hey, Zaki, Zaki. Do you know baby. that she did not even talk? Uh. That beautiful woman with beautiful character did not even utter a word. That's why dog was just shouting. She did not even say anything. She just kept quiet. Hey! But, but wait, where, where did Oga go and bring that, that kind of uh, ma, ma, mad woman? Where, where, where? Zacchaeus, and I jump. Zacchaeus, I'm not going to in Eh? Is he not men? Is he not men and their infidelity? Eh? Is he not them? Look at August's marriage that was made in heaven. Marriage made in heaven. 
even without a child. Oh, other people were envying them. Oh, sand it. Men. Sand it. Men. Must you guys cheat? Hmm? Men will always stain your white. If you like, carry your white from Brooklyn and wear them. They go stain the white. Baby. Baby. I am different. See, baby. If you give me your heart, I will blaster you with love. See, I hold your heart like egg, like this. You know, go touch ground. Ah, baby, baby, see, let me see for you. See, my baby, love you. Oh, my little one. My baby, tomato. I shall love you. My baby, love you. Oh, my little one. My baby, potato. See, I'll be seeing for you. Oh God, don't ever see for my dad was before. I they break you. We never marry. We don't they break record. They if you marry, me. marry now. Nah. You they think for me, Zacchaeus. Bebe. Look at, look at, oh, look at Oga. Look at how Oga brought in devil in his house because of lack of control. Because of lack of control. We know they look Oga. They look me. Men, men, men. men. Most you people cheat with anything in skates. Bebe. Most you people, oh Bebe. baby, me because so that you will start cheating, cheating, cheating. It's in your form, but you're a goosey. Baby, I'll be cheater. I'll be cheater and animal. You will make me to be, be crying like a man. No, 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 you cannot. No, As for, I will not tolerate any form, any type. Of disrespect projected at my wife. Katrina is my first wife, and as such, must be accorded every respect she deserves. I don't care who you are in this house. I don't care if you're Elon Musk. I don't care if you're Bill Gates. I don't care if you're pregnant. What happened in this house yesterday must not repeat itself again. If it does, I'll remind all of you that even without a child, I was happy staying in this house with my wife before all of you arrived. And the same way, I'll throw all of you out if you keep annoying me. You! I went to bed hungry last night. I'm sorry, sir. I'm very sorry. Sir. I slept with an empty stomach last night. If that repeats again. No, it's okay. Please. No, it's not okay. It's not okay. Put on this. It's okay. It's okay. It's not okay. Ah, what is all this? Eh, my wife, my wife, and all this uh, talk of what? See, you have two wives. Point of correction. I am right here, life and direct. Okay, you cannot edit me out of the equation. I am your wife too. You have two wives, all right? And we share equal rights in this house. Mom. Nobody will box me in the corner. Mm. No, 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 no. Nobody. I will Mom, not Mary let that Marcia. happen. Uh -uh. Queen of England, uh. who gave you the permission to speak? <laughs> you will shut up your mouth until I ask you to speak. Because this house belongs to me. Nonsense. Love, it's okay. It's fine. No, it's, it's fine. It's not okay. Madam, so this is talk. It's okay, so leave him. It's not okay. Why are you begging him? Let him do his worst now. Nah. Oh, let him do his worst. If all this is your gimmicks, it's just to, to, to shut me up in this house where I have the right. See, listen and listen very, very good. I have arrived. Do you understand? My two legs are standing on the ground. Yeah. Eh? I am unshakable, unmovable. <laughs> no leave, no transfer. Get used to it. What nonsense? I am an authority in this house. Authority number one. Brother, please. It's okay. We heard everything you said. Are you done? Oh. Are you done? No sense. Say it's okay, it's okay. No, it's not okay. <laughs> I'll continue from where I stopped before this witch interrupted me. Everything I said here must be taken seriously. That's my final warning to all of you. Have I made myself clear? Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. Brother, she's a mistake that will require enough patience to handle. Eh? Well, mistake, I agree. But patience, that's your opinion, that's not mine. Wait, 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 wait. 
did I just hear my name and I heard mistake? Where is the mistake? In fact, you are the mistake. You are the mistake. Hey. In fact, you are a fool. Get out. You are a fool. You are a fool. You are a mistake. How dare you? Do you do? No. What can you do? No. What can you do? No. If it is the wrong arm. No, no, no. no. If it is the wrong arm now. If it is the wrong arm. Hey. If it is going to be pregnant. Hey. If it is the wrong arm. Hey. 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 Your brother should be coming down. Only she should be the one to come down here. I mean, how could she be bold enough to do what she did last night? Eh? Can you imagine? What audacity! No, me, she knows she's a goose that lays the golden eggs. That's why she's doing all of this. Okay. See, that she's pregnant for my brother does not give her the right to insult you. Yes, she owns you maximum respect because you are my brother's first wife. Okay, what if she chooses not to? We have to choose for her. Now, me listen. You need the baby. I mean, we need the baby. Yes, it's whether we'll stoop low and, and conquer. Let's tolerate all her SSS for the sake of the baby. Mm -mm. There is a level we can tolerate. Not everything. Eh? No, this one is too much. David, can you imagine challenging my wife's authority? Chai, just yesterday her bright night was paid. She couldn't even wait for a year. And she's now flexing once with the first wife. Imagine that height of madness. Total madness. Anyways, I made my point very clear. I told them categorically that I won't tolerate any disrespect projected at my wife. I won't do that. Well, it's good the way you sound the warning to them, but just know that it's not going to be that easy. How do you mean? As long as she's concerned, she's your wife and has equal rights with your first wife. Especially now she's the one with the baby. David. Do you want to know the truth? I don't care. My wife is more important to me than a thousand children at what? this point. Yes, you heard me right. Oh, yes, you heard me right. See, eh? I like the way Oga take talk for meeting this morning. I get it to in my boy. He's sweet <laughs> me. Is it you do? He's sweet I me. Oga finish work. See, especially that part. That part where Oga say, if, even if you are pregnant with boy Jesus, <laughs> I can't turn I look at her. She can't lace like that. I can't smoke. Cause we come like mess, she vanish. Why? Oh, got too much. It's sweet to me. Eh? That woman. Hi. That woman. That woman is taking too much already. What did tell you? She's taking too much already. As for God take no come, eh? It's sweet to me, Zacchaeus. Just yesterday. But some people can be very stupid though. Just see X today that they married you. Okay, okay. Just see X today. You don't begin to show yourself. Like this. You de buga. They buga for everybody. They be slap everybody. Eh? You what do you take you to love and respect the first wife that was there? Ask me. What will it take you? Nothing, no. Nothing. But pride. Pride and nonsense ego. No girl, they 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 bully everybody. Just they just slap everybody. Thank God for waiting on God. Ah, you sweet me. Oh God, are you oh God? Ah, you sweet me, but let's see the sweet me. See you now. No worry. Later, go to go check me. Who's there? Come in. Hey, my Danny husband. Good morning, sir. Who's your husband? And what, what do you want? Uh -uh. Okay. My antenatal appointment is today. In fact, this morning. So, you'll be driving me to the hospital at 10 o'clock to see my doctor.
Do I look like an Uber driver to you? I don't understand. You know what? There are taxis everywhere. So if you want to go to the hospital, get a taxi. What I can do for you is give you money. I'll give you some money. You go out there, get a taxi and go to the hospital. I don't understand. I don't know how I... I, I don't understand. I'm lost. So you're trying to say you cannot drop me, the mother of your born child? No, I can't do that. You can't drop me off. Because I'm not a taxi driver. I just, I just said that. Ah, you can't give me a lift. Hey! What have I done? No, 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 Edward, wait, wait. What have I done? What wrong have I done to you to deserve this kind of inhuman treatment? Oh, really? Ah! All of a sudden, you have memory loss. You have a memory problem. You don't remember what you have done. Okay, let me remind you. Forcing yourself on a drunk man is what you have done. Forcing a pregnancy on me to tie me down because I'm rich is what you have done and you should be ashamed of yourself. Look, look, look. I'm tired of hearing all this. In life, happy and ways are loud. Do you understand? It doesn't matter whether I came through the back door or shortcut or it doesn't matter. Yeah. What matters now is that I am now a wife. Okay. Do you understand? Okay. A wife in this house. Okay. As such, I am entitled to every benefit my first wife is enjoying too. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. A round of applause for ah, yourself. It doesn't matter whether I come through back or front. You know, it doesn't matter okay, anymore. Come and tie me up then. Yeah. Come and force me to take you to the hospital. Yeah. Come and do that. Force me. Tie me up. That is what you want. That is what I said. Oh, oh. you want violence. Eh? You want violence. Oh, Please leave my room. I see. No problem. I know what to do. Violence you ordered. Violence you shall receive. I'm not sure this pregnancy is mine. It doesn't look like mine. Look at, look at him. Look at him. Lele. What are you saying? Don't worry. Please leave my room. I know what to do. I'm coming back. I know your type. I have handled your type in the past. You are nothing but, you know, a piece of chin chin. Chin chin like this. That's what you are. If a, 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 a fly. It and shut it. I am coming. Please leave I my room. I know what to do. No sense. What kind of nonsense is this? Mama. Huh? Mama, he refused. He refused. He refused? Yes. Please calm down. Go and sit down. Calm down. Mama, please don't tell me to calm down. Why am I coming down? What is the meaning of this? Mama, it's because of me I'm taking all this nonsense in this house. I mean, what, 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 what? Is, is it a big deal for him to take his pregnant wife to the hospital? What is the big deal about? Is he doing me a favor? Huh? I'm the one that got myself pregnant. Don't I have a husband? Calm down. Why is your son doing this with his, with his big head now? What is the meaning of this? Calm down. Biko, calm down. Calm down, calm down. Mama, please don't tell me to calm down. That calming down is getting me, is get, even getting me angry self. Calm down for what now? It's not like I don't know what to do. There's a limit to every human, human endurance. And my own has obviously got into the elastic limits. Why is it he, he keeps pushing me up and down as if I, 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 I don't know what to do? I know what to do. Nobody should push me as it is now. I'm already, I'm already, I'm, 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 if I'm, I'm hibernating, ready to explode. If he pushes me to the wall, I'll take a decision that is very, very drastic and factor. A decision that everybody's going to regret, though. No, please. No. Uh -uh. It hasn't gotten to that. Mama, it has gotten to that. It has even passed the SF. Kuma, uh -uh. what, do you, what do you mean it, has, it hasn't gotten to that? See, if anybody pisses me off for that, I'm going to leave this house with my pregnancy. Carry my baby and get out of this place. What is the meaning of this after all? I don't even need this child. I don't need a child. I'm doing people a favor. Look at me. I'm just here trying to trying to make sure that your your, your lineage, your, your, your name is, is there for, for the next generation to come. Yes. And you people are behaving as if as if uh, uh, I don't know. See, I know. See, Mama, please, please, please. It's because of you. Oh. Yes. It's because of you. I'm tolerating all this nonsense because I just I just I, I just like you and I don't want to hurt you. That's the mm. truth. I and I know how you have been begging me, crying on your knees every day because of this baby. Yes. That's why I'm tolerating this your big headed son. But he has to be very very careful. So. Otherwise, I'll just go and abort this child once and for all. Yeah, yeah, yes. Oh, yes. I'll abort this baby and rest. Hey! Wait. I am going to talk to him now. Biko, please. Mama, you don't have all the time in the world, though. You don't have all the time in the world. It's just, it's just, just a few minutes that you have. Otherwise, I'll just... That lady is your wife. She's carrying your child. I don't care. She's in this house for one reason. Else, I would have thrown her out. Edward. She has gone to call her police, obviously. Who is that? Mama, of course. Who else? 
Come in. Good morning. I don't need your greetings. Don't greet me. I don't need your stupid greetings. Edward, all I have come to let you know is that if anything happens to that baby, if anything happens to that baby, you will have me to contend with. You will tell the world how stupid you have become. Mama, I need to get something straight. Mm -hmm. So if I don't take that girl to the hospital in my car, she won't go to the hospital or something bad will happen to the baby. Yes, so something like what? Tell me. Oh. Hey, dude. You are not treating that young girl well. I don't know the kind of a heavy charm this witch has used on you. This evil Catherine has used on you. You choose a lady that you have been with for over 10 good years without issue, not even a stillborn, to a young girl, a beautiful girl as that. Edward, you will tell me the color of your senselessness. Yes! Mama, tell that girl, if she cannot go to the hospital in a cab or in a taxi, then she should forget it. Because I, Edward, will not carry her in my car. It's impossible. Because of this, because Mama, Mama, don't, Mama, Mama, this, Mama, be careful. Witch. Mama, Mama, be careful. Because of this week, Mama, be careful. Edward, Mama, because of this Mama, week, Mama, be careful. Because of this week, Mama, get out of my room. What nonsense is this? Because of this week, Mama, respect. Mama, Mama, get out. Go to your father's house. Mama, get out. Go to your father's house. Mama, Mama, be careful. Edward, Mama, be careful. Edward, Edward, what do you need, my wife? Yes, sir. So. Did Mama hit you? Did my father hit you? Am I a bad woman? Am I a bad woman? Leave me, Edward. Come here. Mama, Mama, Hi. Mama, Mama, put me outside together. I will get Mama, put me outside together. Nene, go outside. Go, go, go to the bathroom. Go! Let me know when you're angry. Mama! Hey! Mama! Hey! Mama, stop! Hey! Mama! Hey! Mama, what process is this? Go to the hey. bathroom. Mama, go to your room. Edward! Edward! Edward, I will kill myself for you. Mama, why are you embarrassing me? I will die! What nonsense is this? I will die, you will see. You have no right to come into my room. What nonsense is this? This okay. is my wife. Edward, I'll pack one. Mama, I'll leave my room. Okay. I'll leave. Let me go out of here. Babe, what is it? Don't touch me. What have I done? Did I do something wrong? I am going to leave this house for you and your mother. I'll leave. You leave the house for me. What have I done? I don't know why. Why are you making this life difficult for me? How? Why are you making it look like I'm using a charm on you? I've told you countless times that I have accepted my fate. I now have a co-wife, yes. She is willing to give us a child. A child we've been waiting for. Why can't you just accept this girl as your second wife? Let us be at peace in this house. Please. But I am on your side. We're on the same page. Listen, you know what? It's fine. I'll take her to the hospital. If that's going to make you happy, I'll do that. I give up. I've gotten myself into. What nonsense is this? Woman, can you hurry up, please? I have other things to do. I don't want to keep waiting for you. You're wasting my time. Please, can you can you come? Let me get out of here. I think I have all, all time, all, all, all day. What nonsense is this? Pregnancy and staircase, eh? They can never be friends. 
Where are you now for crying out loud? Young man, please stop shouting. You're wasting my time. I beg, stop shouting, Joe. What is that? I have other things to do at the office. Here. Yeah. Can you hurry up? Other things more important than taking me to the hospital. Are you crazy? Here. Yeah. Oh, hmm. This man, you're looking for my mouth, though. You're looking for my mouth. Ah, ah. Come on, open the door now. Let me enter. Excuse me. I should do what? Because you don't have hands. I don't My friend, put it down and get it. I don't have that time, please. Yeah. Oh. Look at this man. Listen, I swear to God, I'm going to, I'm going to drive off. I don't have this time. Come on to go and drop me at the hospital. You're acting as if you want to go and give me kidney and intestine, dear. Excuse me, you asked me to open the door for you. As what? I don't understand as what. Am I your servant? Is it not obvious? As this. As a woman who want to give to you what your your your, your miserable wife in her ten years listen, has never been able listen to, give to me, you. listen to me. What is it? We have we have to run a DNA test. We're not even sure the child is mine. Look at this one. Yes. They whine me. Get into the car. My friend, come and open this door for me. Let me go and see that I cannot talk. Which one is DNA test to know if the child is yours? You should be grateful to your God. What? what? Listen, we need to run a test, hey. a HIV test, to ensure this child is safe. HIV because test. Because I don't trust you. Hey, hey this man. In fact, uh, you are a comedian, but your joke is not funny. It's not funny because I'm, I'm not even laughing. You want to run a, 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 a test to know if I have HIV? Yes! If I have HIV, then you also have HIV. Yeah! Because you're the one that impregnated me. Okay. What nonsense? My friend... I was, I was drunk and you took advantage of my drunken state. That's, so, that is what you did. This your story is old and still. Get friend. into this car! Okay now, I'm going to go. I will stand here. Let Listen, me see. Get, uh, have, you, uh, have you driven in the Benz before? <laughs> have you driven in the Benz before? Go digger. <laughs> Oh yeah, now when you are done running your mouth, you go and open the, 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 the car for me to go. I'm not joking, no. I'm not even joking about it. Come and open the car. Oh. Get into the car. Come and open the car. Oh. If I change my mind, I will go back inside. I will not go to this hospital today. Come and open the car. Oh. My baby is already vexing. Oh. Come and open the car. Don't annoy me. Oh. You know what? You know yes. you're a witch. Oh, That's God. what you are. You're a witch. I will open the car. Better. 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 Please get inside. Stop screaming, no. Stop screaming at me. I don't want to go to that hospital and they will tell me my, 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 my VP has visited because you are, you, are, you are shouting and shouting and shouting. Can you get Can inside you and stop baby? ranting? My friend, like a market woman. Open this door, wait, let me enter. Have you driven in a Mercedes Benz before? Open this door, let me go and sit down. Have you driven in a Mercedes Benz before? Open this door, let me go and sit down. You're, look, you're busy door. looking for a rich man to pin down. They pay you. Today's your lucky day. They get they in! They pay you. I see they pay you. He they sweet me. I see they sweet me or more. They pay you. Shame on you! My friend, come and close it down. Come and close it down. Why are you inside the car? Man, play music now. I mean, there's no music in your car. Let me, let me enjoy my life. At least I'm sitting inside the Mercedes Benz for the first time, so let me enjoy my life. Here. Yeah. Okay. Wait a minute, what have I even done wrong? What have I done to you? Am I not a beautiful girl? Eh? Take a look at me. I'm beautiful. Above all, pregnant for you. See, as she see me like this, I'm a very sweet girl. I am sweet in the middle, and I know it. Hey, 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 hey! Listen to me. Listen. One more word from you, I'll throw you out of this car. Sorry, sorry. Sorry. Wow. This is me just trying for us to have a nice conversation like adults in love and see, just, just see what you're doing. If you know how sweet I am, I swear to can God. You, can you shut up? Sorry, let's go. Sorry. Local woman. Sorry. Local woman is sweet.
right. There you go. There you go. What for? 10,000, in case you need to pay for anything at the hospital. Wait, wait, I don't understand. So you mean you're not coming with me to make the necessary payments and be part of this antenatal? Listen to me. If you need anything, just call me on the phone and I'll send more money. Hey! I'm late, I'm late for work. I need to go to work. No, 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 no. I'm a, I'm a charity case. No, you don't, wait, are you doing me a favor or I'm the one doing you a favor? Because I really don't understand it. You have all this interested in your head. I am doing you a favor. Giving you something that you're in your entire life you've not been able to, to, to get. I am giving you a baby, a child. Madam, I have to go to work. I'm late. You want to go to work? So that your work, that your stupid work is more important than this child. Please, can you child get out of my car? Your life, get out of my car, please. Life. I am trying to give you what you don't have. What that your stupid job cannot give is what I am providing. But you want to abandon me and go out. I don't blame me. This I'm going to take back this money. See, this thing will cost you. Mm -hmm. It will cost you. You have not seen anything. We are playing with all the Which? Go back to the village and ask about my it. My friend, get out of my car. Don't ask, oh, I will deal with you. I will show you perfect. You have not seen anything. You have not seen anything. Open this door. Hey, hey, don't spoil that door. Hey, open it. Open this door. Hey, don't spoil that door. Hey, please, hey, don't spoil that door. Please, get out. This is a Mercedes. I play with a retired courtist like me. I'll be retired courtist. I will show you. Ah. You are a goat. I will show you that eh, I, I, I did not come, 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 come to this life to, to, to play. Are you mad? Are you mad? You this is a Mercedes. Play with a courtist, Abi. You have not seen anything. Look at girl. Too proud. Are you crazy? I don't have anything. So who do you think you are? Because I'm. You look at girl. Get out. See, I'm a retired courtist. I will show you. Local thing. See your, see your Chanel bag. See your, see your Chanel bag with padlock. This lady is not asking for too much. You should be seen taking responsibility for the result of your actions. I mean, taking this lady to an hospital for Atenetta should be something you should embrace with both hands. David, you don't understand, do you? I hate her. She irritates me. I can't stand the sight of her. You should work on yourself. You need to adapt. Listen, no matter how much you preach hard to me, I'm not interested. I have built my mind to see other women apart from my wife as monkeys. You need therapy? Maybe. Yeah, sure you do. This woman I'm talking about here is about to give you your first child. And you'll be called a father. I mean, what are we even talking about here? David, I'd like to be called a father by my wife when she gives me a child. Not some desperate mistress on the streets. She's no longer a mistress. That's what she is to me.
I was, I, this is this I was in the toilet. I've been having running running some. Are you mad? For the past what three is weeks. my business if you're in the toilet? Three weeks. What Wait. is my business? Sorry. Are you crazy? Sorry. Do what? you know how long you kept me outside? What is wrong with this boy? I was using the toilet. Using See, it. Eh? Your days in this house, eh? It's no matter. Sorry. Come and close the gate. Okay, close the gate! Yes. Fool! Thank you, ma. Wasting my time. Uh -uh. Sorry. Welcome, ma. Your days are no bad in this house. Fool! Oh, my tummy has been doing. Come on, take a go, 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 See my friend. Who is your friend? Uh -uh. My friend, open this gate. What sort of question is that? Open this gate, John. Hey, oh. Okay, now. It's like you don't want to come inside, Abby. Eh? You don't want to come inside. Okay. I am here to see my friend, Catherine. What is that? I said I am here to see Catherine. Is that the name of a new, newly invented disease or something? Kate what? <laughs> Idiot. Whoa! Catherine indeed. Is that animal place or thing? Catherine. What a name. Oh! Yeah! Outside knocking, you know. I didn't know where Zaki went to. That fool, that shamelessly pregnant idiot, was shouting from inside, asking me, "Who is there? Who do you want to see? Can you imagine? Are you serious?" I said, "Okay, oh, maybe she didn't know me, or probably she has never heard my voice." I had to tell that animal that I came to see you, Catherine. At least for peace to reign. Do you know the blessing she did? She just said. It's like you don't want to enter inside. Hey, blah, blah, blah. Like, what the fuck? What? Huh. Oluchi must be out of her mind. Hmm. Listen, uh, Vera. Vera, calm down. So, 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 I don't need to calm down. I do not need to calm down, okay? I am allergic to nonsense. She cannot stand on my nose and get balanced, though. Go and call that fool. Vera. See, Catherine, don't, don't, don't just get me angry. I said, go and call that idiot. Vera, I am pleading with you. Go and go her first. I need to see her. Please, please, please. Let me. Wait, that idiot. Come down. Wait, now I'm looking fish. So, that is how. Yeah, yeah. Oluchi, are you mad or something? Are you on colors? Why are you always like looking for troubles? Why? Maybe he's in America. Check like he has put one at the back and he remember. Mama, can you? Oh, give me. Can you imagine, Mama? Catherine's best friend, Vera, was knocking on the gate. Oluchi saw her and asked her who she came to see. She told her that she's here to see Catherine. Mm. Instead of her to open the gate, she eased and walked out. Okay. Hey. Vera had to keep knocking before Zaki ran out and opened the gate. Can you imagine, Mama? Oluchi. Mama. Hi. Oluchi don't suffer. Uh -huh. In fact, so, I've suffered. 
Where is uh, Zacchaeus? Ah. One bobo. You man, you of sense. You don't have any sense at all. You are a very stupid girl. Someone has been assigned the duty of opening and closing the gates. No. And that person should be punished if he did not carry his duty or do it very well. Why are you against Oluchi? Is Oluchi your gate man? Whoa, ask me oh! Mama, Papa. Ah, so this is all you have to say in this matter? No. This is not all I have to say in this matter. All I have to say in this matter is that you are very stupid. Very stupid. You are a useless girl. How can you... Chotorono, chotorono, chotorono. Eh, he's, he's looking for... Eh, eh, yeah. And instead of only to open the gate, Imagine. I say get man or what? Come on. Are you, are you, are you working with your senses at all? Are you with your senses? Mama. God forbid. Mama, I am highly disappointed in you. Thank you. Look at how your quest to have a grandchild mm. has beclouded your sense of judgment. Mama, may God have mercy on you. You are a very stupid girl. You are a senseless girl. What is wrong with you? Oluchi has been called get woman for this house, Abi. Bia, bia, bia. Oluchi. Mm. Oluchi, be careful in this house. Okay. We've been living peacefully before you came. Okay. Yes. We all accepted that you are pregnant for my brother. Does not mean that you'll be insulting everybody. You know, walk a see on round and round. Okay. I'm going to be careful. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Hey. Oluchi. Ah. I thank God. I said that I am not going to leave. I am going to stay with you because I have known that their plan. You see this thing? Eh? No one will live for each other. But you cannot leave this house for them. Hey. Let's fight for you and you shall go to this. Oh. That's, that's what I maintain. Let me just maintain you. Please, you, you just sit down. Okay? Please go. Please go. Please go. Please go. Please go. Call that girl. I need to see her myself. Vera, please, don't be offended. I've spoken to her. See, see, see. You could just need to call that girl. Call her first. And I need to talk to her. That wouldn't be necessary, please. I know how you feel right now, but please calm down. <laughs> Vera, creating a scene now would not do us any good. You have to let go. Forgive and forget. Be cool. See, mm -hmm. you guys have to warn her. You had better want that girl. She should not try this nonsense with me, oh. Mm -hmm. I am not the person she can toy with. No, she won't try. No, you guys should just call her to order. She okay. won't try it. Biko, mm -hmm. because next time if she tries this nonsense with me, eh? If she dare tries this. Where is Zaki? Zaki! Zaki! Ma, yes, ma. Come here. I don't even know. I don't even know. Yes, ma. Yes. Where were you? Ma. Sir? How was it all that you had the gates when my friend got here? Where were you? Ma, me? Yes. Me. me. Oh. Uh, she, after I opened the gate for Auntie Oluji, she gave me a bag and told him to go and drop it in her room. So I was there when Auntie Vera was knocking. Me, I did not waste time on chicken time. I did not waste time. I came out. Before I came out, she was already knocking. Can you imagine? Sorry, no. sorry. She was even the one that sent Zaki away. Can it's you imagine? Okay. It's, it's hmm? okay. no, no. Can you imagine the rubbish? She was even the one that sent him out. No, me, please. Get us a seat to sit down, please. Very see, please. get in there. You see, you see that idiot. Better one how, my friend. She could. Better one how. It's okay. Let her not try this nonsense with me again. She would not. Be cool. She wouldn't. Then. May she not try and get out. Uh, sorry, sorry, thank you, ma. Sorry. Can you imagine? Eh? It's okay. That's it. Hey, who do you want to see? Sorry. Honestly, I don't know why she's making everything look like we're having a war. She doesn't miss any opportunity to drag positions with me. I don't know. Anyways, I don't blame that idiot. I do not blame that fool. I only blame your husband for not controlling his mind. Now you see what I'm saying. I don't have any problem with this woman. The only person I have issues with is my husband. For sleeping with her in the first place. That is exactly why I wanted to leave this marriage. Anyways, thank God you listened to us and stayed back. 
Because leaving your marriage for that fool was not part of the option, no. I mean, how can you leave your eight years old blissful marriage? Because of that fool. Because of that intruder. Because of that animal that came here as a result of accidental and careless discharge. I mean, think of it. I am not dragging anything with anyone. I have accepted to stay with her. And any reason that will make us quarrel, I'll try as much as possible to avoid it. I will sacrifice anything for the sake of peace. <laughs> that is me. See, don't sacrifice your first wife's position. Okay? Don't sacrifice your first wife's position for that animal. Don't even try it. Okay? Well, you already know I am not the dragon type. Once it possesses as a quarry between you and I, I will just let go. I will leave it for you. So what are you trying to say? Are you trying to say that you're going to leave Edward for her? I haven't said that yet. <laughs> so? I mean, how do you mean you can't drag? Vera, it's it's fine. Everything is going to be okay. You have to take a position. Like, take your rightful position. Don't even think of leaving anything for that girl. Don't, please. Everything will be fine. Huh. Can you imagine? See, she was even asking me, eh, who do you want to say? I can't just fat on it. <laughs> eh? Look at that village rat. <laughs> What are you doing in my house? I, I saw your friend leaving. That is not my question. I said, what are you doing in my house? Um, my love, I know I've wronged you, okay? But please, just give me a chance to make a man, okay. please. Desmond, you came to apologize after how many days, Desmond? Yes, I know, but the most important thing is I'm here now. Please, forgive me. Where is she? Oh. Don't be stupid. Um, okay, I she she left the same day you did. Okay, see, I'm really sorry. Okay. She's not even my girlfriend. I swear. I got attracted to her backside. You know how men are. Please, let's not stop this thing that we've started long ago. Please, Vera, mm -hmm. forgive me, okay? I'm ready to do anything. Please. So this much. Yes, love. Where are you taking me to? Don't you trust me again? Hmm? Hmm. See, Desmond, it is your house. I am not going, okay? You can't take me to your house after the embarrassment. You know how you embarrassed me the last time in front of your neighbors? Wait, wait, wait. Please, I'm not going to your house. Wait, babe. For now. Come on, babe. Wait, I don't understand. What are, you, what are you implying? Are you trying to say that you will no longer come to my place again? Is that what you're trying? Is that what you're implying? Oh, yes. That's what I'm saying this month. Okay? I need to give myself some space before I can pay you a visit again. For now, I'm not coming. Okay, you know what? I'm not taking you to my house. Okay? I'm not taking you to my place, at least for now. I'm not taking you to my place. I want to take you out. I want us to go have a few drinks, like one or two bottles and eat food. Okay, let's mark our reunion after a long time we broke up. Okay? So I'm just going to take you so that we'll just chill and relax and talk. You know, I've missed you, baby. Oh. Mm. See, that's fine. That's good. I hope we're not going to break up again. Oh, God forbid, God forbid, we won't. I see, I promise you, I, you know, I've already crossed my mind. I'm not going to cheat on you again. Never in my life, I won't. I'll never cheat on you again. You promise? Yeah, sure, babe. I won't. Okay. 
All right. Smile for me. All right. <laughs> yeah, I miss This food is tasty. Yeah, I like this place. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Uh. <laughs> oh, babe. <laughs> Your daughter, we are I do actually. Are you serious? <laughs> yes. You like the food? Yeah. I love it. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> so do you want to work out? I'm fine. Okay. I'm okay. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Babe! Hmm? What? 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 looking at? What? 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 I thought I saw you looking at something. No, babes, I'm, not, I'm eating. Come on, eat your food, okay? I'm not looking at anyone. You were. Anyways, forget it. It's okay. fine. <clears throat> okay, babe, just give me a few minutes, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm pressed. I need to ease myself, okay? I'll be back soon. I don't want to waste your time, okay? My girl is here, okay? Please, let me just have your number. <laughs> Alright, so what's your name? Evelyn. Okay, I'll call you tonight, okay? You look beautiful. Oh, hell no. Babe, please, it's not what you think, okay? Baby, it's not Come on, it's not what you think, okay? Just wait, it's not what you think, okay? Please. Say, please, not today of all day, please. After a long breakup, please. See, okay? I Desmond, can explain. Desmond, Desmond, I can see that shitting is in your DNA, okay? Desmond, you don't even have respect for me. <sighs> eh? Not that it's your woman, Desmond. Please, Desmond, don't even have an altar of respect for someone you call your woman. It's not what you think. I was talking to that girl about business. It's not what? You don't have anything said. to say. You know how business is. I was just this thinking This out... I said you do not have anything to explain to me. Okay? I saw you taking the number of another woman. It's business. Are you here lying to me? Desmond. Desmond, today of all days, Desmond. Okay, please. Okay, I, I was just telling you know the girl something Desmond, about... I do not want to ever... See you in my life again. That's not, that's not what's into this. No. That's, and, that's and, what's into and this. don't think it's business as usual. Right. That after it's everything business. you come and take me, I'll take you back. No! It's going to be different now, okay? If I ever see this your tiny legs in my house again, if I ever see this your ugly legs in my house again, then eh? you won't believe what I'll do to you. It's business. I was just trying to talk. Get out of my way! Babe, 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 babe. babe. This one, you too like me, ash. This one, you too foco. Nash, nash, nash. Hey, when will you ever learn this one? You too like me, ash. Eh? Kai, oh, you have your life, Mustafa. Ah. 
Hi. So, your bill is 7,500 now. Ah, oh, God. Um, okay, um, please, just go get your POS machine. Okay. So tell me, where will I start from? Eh? I will explain, explain. I am no evidence. Eh? No evidence. Where, where will I even start from? Ah, God. You know go better for me, show. I swear, you know go better. Hello? <laughs> My sister, you won't believe what happened today. What happened? <laughs> Just as you left my house this afternoon, <laughs> guess who showed up? Oh. Desmond. <laughs> After all the embarrassment the last time. <laughs> My sister, that is not even the point, okay? Can you imagine that he came and the stupid me fell for his gimmicks and forgave him again? Yes, he even took me out today, <laughs> and guess what? The worst happened. Are you serious? What did he do? Hmm. Desmond saw one girl with a big backside. Okay, he was just giving her signs. I was like, I asked him, and he denied it. The next thing, Desmond told me that he wants to go and eat himself, not knowing that I followed him. Do you know what? I saw Desmond giving that girl his number. I was telling her, don't worry, I'll call you tonight. <laughs> Vera, I told you, I told you. Desmond would never change. He will not. Leave this boy alone and move on with your life. Plan your life and let him be. He won't listen to me. Whenever he comes back to me, I can't just say no. I can't. Now you know why. If he comes back to you and you take him back, then don't ever call me on phone and tell me about it again. Hmm. You see, next time, eh, I will not forgive him. I'm serious. I will never forgive him. Better for you. What nonsense. I don't know why you're stopping me from asking this girl to leave this house. She has an agenda to tear us apart. How can she accuse you of assaulting her when you didn't even leave the room? If I had my own child, all of this wouldn't be happening. But why? What have I done to deserve this wickedness? What sin did I commit that the blood of your son cannot erase? To give me just one child, even if it's one, let me be free from all of this. It's okay, babe. Just calm down. Pull yourself together. I don't care. You mean more than 10,000 children to me. No matter what they do to tear us apart, it's not going to work. I'm here for you. But I need you to give me the go ahead to send her out of this house. And watch me do that. With immediate effect. I will leave her alone. People will blame me for supporting you. How can you send the woman who is bearing your child away? Why would you do that? Just leave everything to God. He will judge. He is the only one that has the right to judge us. I will leave everything to him. It's okay. Sure. So. You mean this evil girl beat you? My stomach is still hurting me. That evil girl, it will not work for her. Eh? Don't worry, nothing will happen to your baby. Oh? My is it paining you? Yeah. My stomach is hurting me. Did she hit you that hard? The punch she gave to me. Ah, here. 
here like that. Mm. Oh my God. Don't touch it. Jesus. Don't touch it. It will it will not work for them. The agent of darkness that are working for them, they are not going to succeed. They have failed woefully. Uh -uh. I want to eat roasted chicken. Roasted chicken. Uh -huh. I should not touch it. Uh -huh. Roasted chicken. Let me just... Uh -huh. Upside down. Okay, roasted chicken. Roasted chicken. Okay. Let me go and tell that Aneta. Let her prepare you for you roasted chicken. Oh, tomato sauce. Huh? Tomato sauce. With to tomato sauce. With tomato sauce. Onions. I want the onions chopped. Big pepper. Big. Ah, just green pepper. Not. Okay. And yellow pepper too, please. Okay. You will join all the pepper. Uh, yellow pepper and green pepper. No oh. red pepper. No red pepper. No problem. Let the onions be cut in squares. Okay. time listen let last night be the first and the last you will lay this filthy dirty witch hands of yours against my daughter-in-law next time you, you you hit your hands on her stomach i will deal with you you will not like what i will do to and you who told you that i touched oluchi who told you that if that I am not here to ask whether you touched her or not. I am here to warn you. I am here to warn you. Any day you raise this witchcraft hand against my daughter-in-law, I will make sure I report you to the Omada in the village and they will invite you. You will come and explain why you should hit a woman who is pregnant, your own wife! Mama, I did not touch Oluchi. I didn't even leave my room. When you came to the corridor, did you see me? Well, shut up! What is this? What is this? You did not touch her. It's better. You are a witch. You are a witch. Why am I even calling you and you are going? Don't you know your name? Your name is Witch Oriwa. Bloodsucker. Oriwa. Shame on you. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Are you not? You, 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 every time you carry key, only key each Did you come this house with any key? Did you? Huh? See, where are those children that my son deposited in you? You have sucked their blood. You have eaten them. What do you want for? All you Hebrew, Katarina, or whatever your name is being called. Leave my son alone. Go back to your father. Gawa ben nagikagu bogi. Eh? The purpose of a woman getting married to a man is not in you. So you are equally a man. Why are you doing this to my son? Why do you want to tarnish his image? Close his knowledge. Leave. 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 I will not want you again. Next time you lay this witchcraft, oh, you want to suck her baby too, the way you're eating your own. It will not work for you. It will not work for you. Oh my God, my dog was sick and You forgot again. Leave my son. Now you bend again, I go go again. Nonsense. Touch her again. Touch her again. Koroko died tears. In warfare. Papa. All of these names, 
all because I've not been able to conceive in my husband's house. What is, what is this? What have I done wrong? What? Hmm? This is not the time for you to cry. This is the time for you to take action. Crying will not solve anything. Okay? You have to get up and do something. Eh? Okay, um... There is this doctor that came back from abroad. He specializes in childbearing and infertility. Okay? A lot of people that have gone to see him came back with testimonies. So I suggest, come, let's go and see him. Huh? Vera, I am... I am tired. I am tired of visiting specialists. Where haven't I gone to? I've literally gone everywhere. I'm... See, see babe, you see this very doctor. You need to go and see him. Okay? Something in me tells me that it's going to work. Mm? Let's go and see him, alright? <sighs> I hope it won't end in futility like others. Yeah, so after all this time wasting, the doctor turned out to be like every other doctor's. You're fine. I mean, you're very healthy and fit to conceive and bear your child. <laughs> what if nothing is wrong with you? Yeah. Bear, how can you say what if nothing is wrong? I even say that. So why am I not conceiving like every other woman out there? Babe, you never can tell. The fault might be from your husband. Yes. The last time I took him for a checkup, then I took him to a doctor and they did all the necessary tests. And the doctor confirmed that nothing is wrong with him. Ever since then, he doesn't follow me to see any doctor. He doesn't. You're the one in need here, okay? You have to play your own part very well before you can blame other people. Seriously. What do you mean? What I meant is that if it's going to take you to see 10,000 doctors because of this your condition, you have to be up and doing. Okay? You have to play your own card very, very well. Then you can leave the rest for God. Vera, you don't get it, do you? No, I don't. All these things, like seeing different doctors and hearing same stories are frustrating. Like, I am tired of it. I can't be wasting my money, my time, on these fruitless exercises. It, it, it's, it's annoying. Something like this can actually lead to depression. Yeah, I understand, okay? But babe, you have to be strong. You have to be strong, everything will be fine, okay? Very yeah, honestly. I am tired of jumping from one doctor to another. A fruitless venture, that is it. I am tired. Don't sound like this, okay? I believe that this one is going to be your last bus stop. Huh? The testimonies are high. Come, let's go and see him. Something in me tells me that this one will work. Alright, we go. What are we doing? Why did I call in the first place? We're going to see him right away. Alright? Um, yes! A stitch in time saves nine. Come, let's go. Now. Yes. Let me go and bring my shoes. I'm coming.
Madam, you, you will need to come with your husband. Doctor, please, tell me what you found out first. What is wrong with me? Actually, I'm suspecting something. But I need to run some tests on your husband to confirm my suspicion. Are you saying you will not tell me the outcome of my own result? Okay, I wouldn't want to give a half-baked information. I will want to give a concise analysis on your case. And that can only be done after I've run some tests on your husband. The problem might be from your husband. Fair, what are you saying? Eh? When someone is already pregnant for him. Okay, so how is Aluchi pregnant? Just in one night sex. The doctor never said so, okay? He said he needs to confirm some things by running some tests on him. He has not concluded yet. Hmm? So. Vera, I do not think my husband would like to follow me to that place. He won't. Ah, babe. Babe, you need to force him. You really need to convince your husband to come and see this doctor. Okay? You are the one that is wearing this shoe and you know exactly where it pinches. I believe at the end of the day, there will be a positive result. Because this very doctor is different from other ones. Amen, no. Amen. Because I'm tired already. I believe that it will end in praise. Okay? It's, in fact, it's already ending in praise. Amen. So, because of my mother's harsh words, you want to see a doctor? No, babe. Vera had earlier called and said she wanted to discuss something important with me. I was on my way going to her house when Mama stopped me. I started reading insults on me. It was when I finally got to her house that she told me everything and told me about the doctor. And the doctor asked you to bring me over? Yes. Did you tell him someone is pregnant for me? No, I didn't. That should have helped. Baby, the doctor never said it's your fault. I mean, he said it. He's suspecting something and he wanted you to come over so he would run some tests and be sure of his suspicion. Are you doubting my love for you? Do you know I still love you so much? And nothing will change that. Do you know that? I know. And I love you more. Madam, someone just paid for your goods and you can't come in. I came here alone. What are you saying? Uh, the person paid in advance and we don't accept do, uh, double money and it's against our policy. So, who is this gentleman? He is outside the bank. Okay, you should continue. Thank you. Okay, nice. See you next time. Outside. Desmond, did you pay for this? Yes, I did. See you. 
I... Thanks anyway. But it still didn't change anything, okay? Did you get that? Yes, love. I understand how you feel. You understand, but we can talk about this, you know, right? We can. See, this month, stop calling me your baby. I am not your baby. Do you get that? Yeah, come on. Sorry. Let's see. This month, if you ever block me again, eh? if you ever block me again, I'll call the security on you. I will tell the security that you want to rape me. Rape you? How? Come on, I'm trying to talk to you. What's Fool! Wait. Wait. Wait now, wait. To help you, I'm not kidnapping you. Just come in. But please stop. Just, just stop this, okay? Right? Don't worry, eh? Let me go in and boil water. I see this your stupid face. I will disfigure it today. Vera, come. See, you can pour me the hot water. Yes, I deserve it. If that's the punishment I get, if that hot water can even reset my brain and make me value what I have, just pour me the hot water. So far, it's coming from you. I deserve it. Why do you keep doing this to me? <laughs> this month, why do you keep breaking my heart? Hmm? <laughs> it's because you know that I love you. <laughs> and I will always take you back. My love. <laughs> why are you doing this to me? <laughs> you know, I have come to the conclusion that I can't live without you. You are the part of me that must live for my life to continue. You are the air I breathe, but I can't do without you. It's my love. Please, will you marry me? I promise I will never cheat on you again. I promise. Please say yes. Please. Yes, I'll marry you. Thank you very much. I will never cheat on you again, I promise. Okay. Thank you.
Uh, Mr. Edward, the truth is that in your present state now, you cannot father a child. You can only father a child when some corrections are done in your system. You need to balance your hormonal imbalance. That's the only time you can father a child. I'm trying to understand you, Doctor. Uh, I wouldn't like to use the medical terms for you, but let me just break it down for you to understand. The solution for your problem has been found. The cause of your childlessness for 10 years is known now. And there is a solution. So what behoves on you right now is to take the practical steps, follow the medicational routine, and the corrections will be done. You'll be free, you'll be able to follow the child. Um, but doctor, I just um, I just married a girl who claims she's pregnant for me. Pregnant for you? <laughs> she must be joking. What? Yes, she's joking. What do you mean joking? Oh, wait, wait, doctor. You're saying that there is no chances of my husband getting a woman pregnant at all? Not until the corrections are done. Things are getting more complicated. I'm telling you. So who's responsible for her pregnancy? I'm telling you. I don't understand. A direct test we ascertain that if you can get the said lady here, you can run a DNA test on her. But I must tell you the truth. You are not the father of that child. You are not responsible for that pregnancy. I am sure. I am very certain of that. Are you saying we can run a DNA test to ascertain who the father is? Yes. Okay then. I will get her right away. All right. after the DNA test. I am not responsible for that pregnancy. I will deal with that girl. I will. She's not even sure of the pregnancy and she's already loading into vomit. Accusing me wrongly. Trying to tear my family apart. What nonsense is this? Baby, you need to calm down. Please, you need to relax. I'll deal with her, I promise you! Baby, I'm talking... What?! Listen... I don't want you to go there and start shouting at her. Please, just tell her that we need to run a DNA test to ascertain the fertility of our child. After the result is out, you can take whatever decision you want to take. Please, just calm down. You alright? <sighs> If you have money without a child, you are in trouble in this part of the world. All you has got to stay. Oh, she carries my mad desire. All you has got to stay. Evidence, you are my 
anything, any problem. Where is Oluchi? She's in her room. Please call her for me. Mama, call her for me. She's praying. And the way she prays, nobody disturbs her. Mama, what do you mean by that? What nonsense is that? Please call her for me. What stupid prayer is that? No. She is praying. And when she prays, nobody interrupts her. I'm up on the hour. Edward, come back here. Come back here. Edward, come back here. Edward! Forgive me. Mama, I'm sorry. I, I didn't plan to do it. No. The devil just tricked me. Oluchi, mm -hmm. that's your name, right? Oluchi is your name, right? You're trying my patience. I swear to God, I'm going to give you a punch right now. It's, um, um, <laughs> I, 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 Listen, are you trying my patience? Is that what you're doing? I was just... Speak. I wanted to say it. Okechuku. It was Okechuku that planned everything and invited me. I was just on my own, JJ Leo. I, I, I didn't want to be a part of it, but... He made me a proposal and I, I couldn't refuse. I'm sorry. Okay, how I'm fine. You don't ask after me now. Uh, you, you ask of me? Of course. I hear you. Um, Long time. Uh, yes, now. I did. You don't see him now. Uh, Oli, baby, I have some good news for you. Good news? Yes. What is it about? Um, you know, you've lived all your life here. You attended your primary, secondary school here in the village. Mm -hmm. And you now run a mini business here. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't you like to marry someone from here? Is this the good news you're talking about? I better tell me better to enjoy. Answer me first now. Ha! Even if I want to marry a person from here, I'm not a man. I may go marry myself. I'm not a man to decide where to marry from and where not calm to. Calm down, calm down. Ha! What if I tell you that I have a man for you? A wealthy man at that. Yes. See, if there's anything you want to tell me, just go straight to the point. Because I don't get patience. So. Um, but you know, you need to book an appointment first. Yes. Appointment. So you know if you tell me like this, no, 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 like this. Holy, we can't talk about such sensitive matters in the open. Okay, so what thing we go do now? You know what? Uh, mm. It's okay. Thank you. Let's go. Man, you're looking good. Thank you. I can see your business is doing good. We'll try. So what's up? Waiting day. You have to open up and tell me everything. I need to know. You understand? Because this seems to be more about your interest than mine. You understand which I they talk? So there's no point hiding anything from me or coding. Just open up, make I know what I want to enter. 
If I want to do, I'm going to do. If I don't want to do, I'm not saying nobody go force me. I'm not a child. You understand? Yes, uh, Oli, I understand everything. Mm -hmm. You see, Edward and I have been rival right from childhood. We attended the same primary, secondary education. He used to carry first, I'll carry first. We in short, we used to drag the first position. Not until we finish our second education, we want to further. Somewhere along the line, I dropped out. I continued. You see, I had a dream that both of us were standing on a cliff and he pushed me from the cliff. I fell down and he alone was standing on the cliff. Okay. Yes, um, so I went to meet a spiritualist and he told me that everything was clear. That everything I saw in that dream was true. That he's going to take my position. And I'm going to suffer the rest of my life. And it happened to be true. Here I'm in the village suffering while he's in the in the city living large. Okay, so like I said, it's very obvious that you want to do this for revenge purposes. I mean, now I've been talking now from the beginning. So how do I come in? How does someone want to pay me? Like, what's my own in all of this? Why me? What can I do in this? It's not just revenge for me. I want to take back my place. I want to take back my money and my wealth from him. Yes. So how you want to take drum? Ah. <sighs> I'm going to use Edward's mother at the aspiration to have a grandchild. I will use it to end, enter Edward's life. And my ultimate goal is to kill him and elope with his money. Yes. Um, okay. Um. I'm going to convince um, Edward to come spend some time with me. And I will make him to get drunk. And I'll um, convince him to spend the night with me in a hotel. While you sneak into the hotel and sleep with him. That's all. Then after eight months, you resurface. Coming out from your hiding. You go and meet his mother and tell her that you are pregnant for Edward. That's uh, all. Wait. What is the guarantee that I'm going to get pregnant from the night that I slept with him? See, it's not, it's not must you must get pregnant. All I need from you is just to sleep with him. That's all. Okay. Don't worry, don't worry. See, I have everything planned out. I will arrange a fake pregnancy for you, which we use after eight months, then, you know, you kill him, you poison him slowly, and then we eloped with his money. She carry, she carry my man's desire. 
What do you stand to gain? 